security prison, home to some of America's most. I guess we're starting another video in this series of day after birthday hangover. Genesee Brew House Orange Honey Cream Ale. Okay. This one has an IBU rating too. I'm guessing it's gonna be like a pale ale. Oh, six percent. The last one was heavier. Had a buddy drive this all the way back from uh, the Genesee River area. Was that Rochester, New York? And this fucking guy. Arthur Shawcross. He's a Genesee River killer. And I guess uh, he threw a lot of bodies in the Genesee River. And um, I guess that's the water they use to make this fucking beer. This is pretty weird and crazy interview with the serial killer yeah he was a murderer motherfucker I know a guy that said they interviewed him back in he called him Artie Choke cause he's a choke and <laughs> strangle his victims Artie, Artie Shawcross the Genesee River Killer this is a pilot batch so I guess it's like something they're proposing uh, I've had some in my fridge for a while. I'm skeptical on drinking this one. The last one was good. Tastes like an IPA. It's now like 9:45 in the morning. But this is my day off. This is the day after my birthday, and I need some hair of some dogs that bit me. A lot of dogs bit me. It smells citrusy. It's got some citrusy smelling. Oh, definitely. It tastes more like lemon than an orange. The honey, I get more from the smell. I only taste the honey. I smell the honey. It just makes me taste it. It's okay. It's pretty good. Not something I would drink every day. I don't like that sweetness thing and the, the weirdness. Taste the honey now. It's more like a lemon honey. It kind of tastes like tea. God damn. Right, not my super favorite ish. -ist. I'm just gonna slowly drink this one. And ponder upon things. Probably taking that. Not a bad beer. I can at least say I tried it though. Genesee. Honey and lemon, what is it? Fucking honey, honey orange, honey orange, honey. I don't know. Pretty good though. Not the greatest beer on earth, but it's alright. 